Podcast Ranger. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Extra Extra Cast Ranger. This episode is brought to you in part by Pepsi. It is. And Pepsi, for when they don't have Coke. It is. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck oh. you, Coke for when they don't have Pepsi. Well played. <laughs> Coke wins. Oh, I know. Oh, <laughs> you're in her own bed! All Easy. I know is that the man in the sky says that Coke is the superior soft drink. All I know is, I'm actually right, and you know it. <laughs> I don't like Coke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I used to like Coke, but now they're they but they like added something. Yeah, into the, yeah, the other culture. kind of Coke. No, no, it's Coke. not that they added something. It's that they took away all the Chinese kids' tears. <laughs> <laughs> do you guys remember? That's guys, because QAmon's been stealing the. Do you guys remember oh. Coke Two? No, no, I, one does. I remember many of the Cokes that came out during the eighties and nineties. Uh, so yeah, uh, people may or may not recognize the voice of... I'm older than most of you! Pa- Paul dropped his balls. <laughs> okay, he beat me by two years. Um, any hardcore Cast Ranger fans will recognize the voice of our guest, special guest tonight. Please introduce yourself, sir. I'm Jarek the Bard from Chasing the Muse, and Terrible Warriors, and other stuff. Wait, 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 Jarek, And stuff. Are you trying to say that we have fans? I, I... Apparently. All I know Wait, is Grandpa Raven fans? isn't the oldest in the room today. Yay! Yay! Now we have Grandpa Derek! <laughs> Tell us Back in my day! See, the important thing about this story is I had an onion on my belt, which was the fashion at the time. <laughs> See, he embraces it, Raven. Yeah. <laughs> we have an ongoing Grandpa Raven joke. Grandpa Raven. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Raven, is it true you trained One Punch Man? <laughs> <laughs> All right, that, that happened pretty recently, so I don't know how... Back in the day, we used show. to call him 100 Punch Man. That's how many punches it took for him to get off, and... Uh, oh. It, he was a sad motherfucker back until we trained him how to actually punch things. His form was terrible to begin with. His form was so terrible, the punching bags would punch him back. And I used to say, damn it, Caillou! Well, kid, I don't know what the hell your problem is. I don't know what, why you ain't got no hair on your head, but uh, you ain't got no hair on your head, so you gotta have hair in your fist, son. <laughs> Wasn't this a news show? Never was a news show. One Punch Man, brought to you in part by Ruffles. Well, okay. there isn't Lays. <laughs> <laughs> Again, fuck you. I'm on tonight! <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah, Lays. on my nerves. <laughs> As is tradition. Okay, so, um, moving Wait, on so to I'm our actual news stories. So, are actual news stories? I know, right? It's a, it's a fucking need, wonder. We do news? <laughs> wait, wait. Are, We're on a podcast? Like, is this, like, real news, or is this, like, corp line news? This is Tokusatsu news, wait, which is we, mostly toy announcements. Wait, we've so. been recording Toys? <laughs> T-O-Y. Uh, actually, you know what? This is... It was really nice. Uh, Itchy actually gave me a toy today. Yes. And it was like an actual toy, not like some weird sex toy out of his room. <laughs> although... Oh, it was a sex toy. Although, considering who uses it... Oh, it's true! It's kind of a crapshoot when it comes to Uh Derek is moving to Edmonton, and this is his last week in Toronto, so is he going away <gasps> no present? No, no, no shit, actually. My, uh, I head up to Ottawa on Tuesday to see my parents for a few days, and I head to Edmonton in time for Christmas. Nice. And then I start work there, and uh, I leave all you guys behind, and it oh, sucks. But uh, that's part of why I invited you here to hang yeah, out with us. Yeah, and I brought, I brought cake, and uh, and it was devoured. <laughs> it, oh my god! The first th- I walked in the door, and the first words out of someone's mouth were, "So I heard you have cake." Yeah, I spread that the legend. Be, that would be Kevin. And that <laughs> shit was inhaled. Oh, yeah. I, I got the last piece. Yeah. Gar got here, and he's like, "So I heard there was cake. Where the fuck's the cake?" God. <laughs> I almost cried when I found out. No, no, his face cake. fell. His, <laughs> it, it was a sad, sad day in the Cast Ranger household. Hashtag sad I had to work dark. solo by myself. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, like I was saying, to celebrate your departure, I gave you my uh, candy toy Durian Loxseed. Oh. Durian which, oh. uh, which I know you enjoy because you had borrowed it for that one video. Mr. Dangerous! <laughs> uh, Bravo is my favorite character out of Kamen Rider Gaiden. We, so. we, we have maintained that the next Kamen Rider Gaiden Gaiden has to be Bravo Gridon. Oh! Yeah. Awesome. Alright! Okay, news story. to the news! I'm sorry. It's all good. No, no That's problem. Cool. Um, so, uh, first thing to mention is that Drive the Type Lupin episode, as well as the Ninja Dinosaur Lord movie, are now out, so hopefully we'll be seeing those soon. Yay, Whoa. I want more Drive in my life, please. I want more Kamen Rider Lupin. Fuck everyone else. Vengeance of Lupin just pissed me off recently, so... Oh yeah? yeah. Why is that? 
Because nobody's subbing the new Lupin series. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Muffin. So isn't, Lupin oh. Gain, isn't Lupin the third guy in its own live action film? Probably, yeah. So what? Like there's live action movies. So there isn't so one what, already? Like the ninth one? Yeah, I was like, what? There isn't movies. No, there's new live Man, action movies. Okay. Who, the, the, Lupin in this is based on Arsene Lupin, right? Yeah. Who would have ever thought that a relatively minor French pulp character, essentially, would grow into this whole phenomenon in Japan of all places? Yeah. yeah. He got one show in North America. That was it. Oh, yeah, we did. He got Knighthood. Yeah, I fucking love well, Knighthood. Made in Canada? Yeah, I, th- I think it was made in Quebec. I think it was the same studio that did Cyber Six. Pretty sure. Oh, yeah. that, there was an that's episode, the Markham There was Floyd. an episode where Lupin was being hunted by Herlock Sholmes. <laughs> Kitty. Shut up! It was a good show. No, it was an oh. awesome show. The opening was fucking epic. Yeah. Uh, actually, fun little fact: the first loop in the third movie is actually directed by Hayao Miyazaki. That's the first? I'm pretty sure that's just the best. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. He's that was, right. Yeah, that was his first movie, Hayao Miyazaki. That was his first movie. Yeah. That he was allowed to direct. Shit. Was a Lupin movie. Okay. <laughs> but but it's it's like holy shit! The 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 character that's getting all these movies, all these TV shows. Is a fucking French character who was made for I think it was like what a couple of pulp novels or a yeah. serialized magazine story. Yep. Um, and that's it. In France, this guy's not a big deal. But <laughs> no, no, it would be as if Sherlock Holmes had become a big thing in Japan instead of becoming a big thing in North America. Incidentally, Sherlock Holmes, one of the first characters to ever fight the Ku Klux Klan. Oh, <laughs> I'll never forget Sherlock Holmes in the twenty second century. So now, so now, you know, so now with Connor, Lupin, Japan's like, all right, we, we've we've turned Lupin into everything. What haven't we done yet? We haven't made him a common writer. Done. Of course. <laughs> Print that shit. And he has a cape. That's kind of cool. Uh, and a mustache. Yeah. I still hold out hope that one day we will get uh, a Sentai based on pulp characters. <laughs> that they'll just run out of ideas and we'll have like a Doc Savage Sentai team. Oh my god. Uh, with like, like fictional fictional Sentai yeah. s- store ranger. Pulp ranger or pulp something. Ranger. Yeah. Ranger. No, pulp rangers and their leader is, uh, oh fuck, what's his name? The guy who directed Pulp Fiction. Quentin Tarantino? No, yes. no, no. <laughs> so like... Uh, no, no, no. special guest Ranger? director on one episode. The Quentin Ranger. They don't, they don't have to. They get to Takashi Miike to direct it because they're buddies. And then Tarantino will cameo. <laughs> as like a monster As, as the Quentin Ranger. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Quentin Tarantino shows is the only white man to appear in the series. Yes. Anyways. Anyways. Uh, yeah. Speaking of upcoming <laughs> Sentai, let's talk about the reveal for Dobutsu Sentai Juoger. Yeah, yeah. Minecraft oh, Sentai oh Pixel Ranger. Yes. <laughs> it's, I, I like, not wrong. I, I like their suits. Yeah, let's talk about the suits. Oh, wait, first. I just actually... Re- no, wait, never mind. I, I was going to say, you like that? Okay. I, I, I like the... The red suit is just... It, the symbol on it is just indistinct enough in the picture that it looks kind of cool. I only just realized they've got their animal silk screened onto their shirt. It yeah. looks like fucking MS Publisher clip art! You know what it looks like? It looks like, you know those trailer trash who have, like, sweaters of, like, just an animal face? Yeah. 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 You know what I do appreciate, though? The Red Ranger's mouthpiece is yellow. Yeah. 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 Bird. You know what I th- my immediate thought was looking at this? Three out of five of these look like they could be g- based on the greed. <laughs> And if the Green Ranger was gray, then we had four. Yeah, looking at these suits, yeah, like, um, I don't know, they're just a little too... They, they almost look kind of parody-ish, if uh, you get what I mean. You know, I... Like, I, I really oh, there's like, the Shark Ranger. Yeah. There's just a big I, shark. I, I mean, the, the, the helmets are okay. I like yeah, I was gonna say... Like, Although, like okay, let's, let's be helmet. honest, though, it's pretty hard to fuck up an animal-themed helmet. Yeah. Have yeah, you seen a true. bad one yet? I can't think of one. Let, Even the Ghost Sagers had great looking helmets. Let's talk yeah. about the Megazord. Okay, so... Oh, the Pixel Zord. We Jesus. scroll over a little bit to the, the first shot of the Zords. Oh my god. So they're actually going with the Cube Zord motif. Yeah, it's Minecraft, man. It's uh, actually Minecraft all right. Zords. Alright, are you ready to be transported to 2001? Cubix robots for everyone. I'm Fuck! Cubix! <laughs> you. No. Cubix! Okay, so, so, appar- you, so apparently I'm how... You so apparently how the primary Megazord works is you actually stack the th- first three Zords, which are the Red Eagle, the Blue Shark, and the Yellow Lion, in a tower formation, and then you shove the sword, which has the helmet on it, 
all, through all three of them, and that's how the Megazord opens up to form its battle that mode. looks awful. Skewerzord! No, it, it literally okay. fucking looks like someone just built it in Minecraft just on a lark to set it, just put it somewhere. I was, okay, I was saying this earlier. Yes, the Megazord looks bad, but oh. given, given what its concept is, endless amount of combinations. Uh, oh my god, wait a second. It has a mouth on its crotch. Yeah, <laughs> uh, that, that just kind of registered with that it had. I don't oh. even register an issue with that anymore after Bonero. A after Fair. Train Dick? Yeah, yeah no, after no, Train no, Dick, no issue. No, motherfuckers, that's motherfucking Venom Myotismon. <laughs> kind of. How does it look down, though, with that giant bird thing in front of its face? Megazords don't need to look down. Know. It probably they needed to forward. get some. It probably needed to get some advice from large-breasted women or something. Okay. Go, go back to the, the swords go themselves. Down. Like go back left quickly. <laughs> it's just the lion sword. I can't take seriously. It's not uh, a fucking uh, square uh, face. Uh, well, I mean the fucking square mane. Look yeah. At this, look, look, zoom in real close, and you can see, look at the mouth on this thing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's going. Uh, Hey, you know what it reminds me of, kind of? The Cowardly Lion from Wizard of Oz. <laughs> that, that, <laughs> combined with the Pink Ranger Zord from Decker Ranger. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Just the thing sticking up, like, stop! So, yeah. so, wait, where do the elephant and, um, what's the other one? The, the tiger? Oh, no, th th this is gonna be like... Yeah, apparently... Uh, like, Kyuru Yuger, where you only had three of them form a, a Zord, and yeah, like, Zord form a yeah, like, time, yeah, in this one shot over here, you can see the other Zord, so they do have... The elephant, the tiger, and apparently a giraffe zord, and whatever the fuck this thing it's is up top here it looks like yeah, a this gorilla. Big zord. So apparently, what happens is the this red, face. blue, and yellow zords combine to form their primary mecha Juo King, and then the other ones combine to form their secondary mecha Juo Wild, which we mentioned on the rumors last week. That's no, interesting. I, I like animal themes, but right now this is really underwhelming. So basically, this is a three-person Sentai base. Yeah, essentially. No, you know what it is? It's Go Under. In terms of the Megazord configurations. I guess. Yeah. Um, speaking of the secondary Megazord, there was a, a shot from the filming set of just the the pieces of Duo Wild suit just, like, sitting in cages. Well, that cannot be fun to wear. No. Like, Jesus Christ, that literally looks like someone's cosplay. Yeah. Yeah, it does look like it's made of cardboard. At least it'll be easy to make for cosplayers. Just you take you some know boxes what? And bam. I, I have this mental image... That within a couple weeks of this coming out, in time for a convention, Featherweight's just going to get a bunch of emails. So I hear you work with cardboard boxes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm just, oh, my God. I just... Okay, let me say this, please. Okay, so you know how in Japan, you know, uh, you know, parents tend to be overbearing? Uh-huh. Right? And, okay, so there's, like, a suit actor for this, right? Who's in that thing. And his parents watch it for the first time, and the dad just cries out, A box! My boy's a box! Damn you! A box! Box is your name! Man, I'm just reaching. You guys lost me. Actually, Simpsons. Should, should, should I talk about the suits? Because if, you, if, like if you have oh, opinions, yes, you have an are. All week he's been like... No comment. No comment. No comment. So what do you think of everything? I got nothing. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> Uh, I've been, uh, I've been uh, trying to think uh, of what to say about these suits all week, and I haven't realized. Gar, that was the Tomorrowland of comments, okay? No, 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 it's more or less like, I just don't know what to say about these suits. You know what I just noticed about the Blue Ranger? Like, right where, as vulgar as this, like, right where her boobs are, there are just shark teeth. Yeah. No, this it really... reminds me of my Friday nights. Don't it looks like they just are. got their uniforms <laughs> fucking silk screen for 20 bucks each. Yeah. Yeah. But by yeah. well meant. I love the Megazord. You're Someone in. had to. Yeah, no. To, dude, Lane. somebody other than the Lane. person no, who designed let, it had let, to. Let's take a look. The metric for success. Lane, do you like that Megazord? No. It may actually be good then. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, we love it. Lane, you. it's a pity you ate that ice cream earlier because now you might want it for that burn. <laughs> <Whoa>! <laughs> Um, so, I, I don't know. I was. Saying, I like bad things, apparently. You know, other than you let's do. say here you like Forza. Other than uh, hey, hey, fuck you. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. oh yeah. damn awesome! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wait, 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 Lane. I want you to understand this though. He likes Forza, and he's being banished to Edmonton. Just oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, you know duck. I need to punch him. <laughs> Come here, motherfucker. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
I actually do enjoy these suits. I, I you really also like oh, you do have an opinion. Yeah, yeah, I just yeah. I I, oh. I just they thought really it right now. Like, okay, I'm gonna have to see them in motion just because I like I like, I like the helmets a lot. Yeah, but the it's just weird. They could have done something a lot better with the chest yeah, design. The problem is they it's look fucking too, clip art again. That's the problem. Maybe if they'd done like the animals in like a stylized way, yeah. it might have looked cooler. But as is, it's just, it's a print. Yeah, no, and that's the, it's not even a well-centered print is the problem. Yeah. Get me those I think the blankets. angle of their poses is part of the problem, but Could anyways. Be, but again, I have to see them in motion before I can make yeah. a final verdict. But. Um, more information we had about uh, their changers and possibly a power-up item. Uh, Mr. S of CS Toys made some comments after reading through the Georgia toy catalog. Uh, apparently their henshin device is a Juo changer, which is a motherfucking Rubik's Cube. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I knew a Rubik's Cube was going to come into play. Raven, we need to get fleet sauce. <laughs> which they have to solve to transform. No, he won't. I know he won't. Um, and apparently they're... I can imagine that'll be, that'll be some really... Uh... Long transformation times in the beginning. <laughs> All right, bro, I got how it. Do I got you know it. what? Now, so I, I suspect they're going to be chosen in like the last Starfighter style, <gasps> where it's like National Rubik's Cube Competition. <laughs> you five to solve Rubik's Cubes. Yeah. Well, the side that you solve the cube on is your colors of power rate. That's a Sentai. <laughs> Here's your changer. Oh, Jesus. this looks like another Rubik's Cube. Yes, yes it is. <laughs> solve that one. You, you know, it took me a week to solve that one. Well, shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And there are six sides to a Rubik's Cube. Yep. Oh, oh God. So, uh... Wait, so I wonder if that means we'll get, like, color mashups in their suits or you know something. What I, you know what I... You know what I'm... My about is, that... Go ahead. Uh, they also talked about something called the Instinct Awakening Mask, which is a toy face mask saying that it is red and the mouthpiece flips to change into another animal, i.e. eagle to gorilla. What this might mean is that Juo Eagle, the Red Ranger, can change modes slash power up into Juo Gorilla. Ooh. So Or they the, all can. So Bird transforms <coughs> into a gorilla. This is just him talking out of the toy catalog. Yeah. What, so. what, let me ask you something. What is your favorite animal themed Sentai or Power Rangers? Gower Ranger. Hands down, Gower Ranger. I liked Go Busters. I really Go Busters is not an animal Sentai I, dick. I, I there are animals in it. I really Rain, like Jungle though. Fury. No, Go Ranger. No, Ranger. No, yeah, no, Ranger. no, no, Fury, no. I didn't like Gecky Ranger. I've got, I've got the correct answer. Dobutsu Sentai Go Busters yeah, from go. the Go Buster Returns. All right, movie. that's. A I'm, bit, a, I'm no. a say, I'm a say Zoo Ranger. <laughs> that's <laughs> dinosaurs. No, minus minus, okay, minus the saber no, tooth no, tiger. No, I will admit. I do not qualify Go Busters as an animal theme sentence. No, it's spy no. themed. Yeah, yeah, it's spy theme, and they just have animal swords. Yeah, no, <laughs> like with Ghost Sager. Yeah, like Ghost yeah, Sager is not an animal sentence. No, 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 I actually like Gekki Ranger. Yeah, really I, I wasn't fond of what I watched of Gekki Ranger, but I really love Jungle Fury. Um, Jungle Fury is a lot. Jungle Fury, I always said though, I like the theme song, but it has said some of the dumbest lyrics, like "Daishi, go away, we're gonna sing the dance." Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's just so oh, yeah, oh, gee, yeah. just I, so yeah, upbeat. No, no, we're in the Power Rangers Jungle Fury. So, I just, I just realized something. Yes, they probably took inspiration from blue and green from Jungle Fury. Think about it: elephant and shark. Yeah, Ooh. well, shark is always blue. Yeah, yeah. but yeah. green elephant, elephant though. There's been yeah. several blue shark rangers. Yeah, but green elephant is yeah. That's right out of the. Well, yeah. actually, that's out of Power Rangers because there was no. Yeah, Gekki that was from green. Jungle Fury. Yeah. Um, the Spirit Rangers. That, yeah, but those yeah. weren't in Gekki Rangers. Yeah, I know. That's what I was saying. Like, yeah, so yeah, dude. Possible. All right. Anyway, we got, more, we got more news. Yeah. Um, there were a couple of posts about rumored casts for uh, Juoger. In addition to uh, the one we mentioned last week, Ryota Kobayashi, also seen with uh, Yakumo Kato, or the guy who plays Yakumo from uh, Ninja. Tsurugi Watanabe. Oh, Aww, look at that baby face. <laughs> and, uh, Jesus Christ, though, like, I looked at this picture, and you gotta see the video version of this. I just glanced over it quickly. Just the way they're all standing, and they all like, got their arms in front of them, it looked like they're all taking a leak. Yeah, that's exactly what I and, thought. And I know it. Wait, that's a woman. <laughs> <laughs> the one in the green. Still standing. Hey, you don't know that for sure. Yes, I do. Look at them legs. You don't know that for sure. Look at them heels. You don't know that for sure. Speaking of women, Japan. the other rumored cast member is... Fair. The other uh, rumored cast member for Georgia is Moe Arai, who played uh, Tsukasa's sister in the Decade movie. Oh. Uh -huh. oh. She was a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Lane, you know what I love about you? I have no idea where you're going. I know, but right? It's just like you sound so... In oh! She's a bitch. <laughs> Fuck her. Well, it's true. Fuck that guy. She tried to kill her brother for abandoning him. 
Her, her. Sorry. That's the he character. abandoned himself. The, we're talking about the actress, not the character. Yeah. Maybe she's a bitch too. Who knows? Sukasa, Sukasa was With a that, bitch. Maybe the, no. Maybe the white ranger in Georgia will be a bitch. Who knows? Uh, I'm not a bitch. Moving uh, on. What the fuck is what? that thing? What we're looking at now is the third writer for Kamen Rider Ghost. Oh, Kamen Rider Necron. Oh, he's green. Finally got revealed. No comment. Well, we knew that from the silhouette. I, that's, I, I don't care, That's Gar. a kind you of... You know what? From now on, your, your input's invalid. No, no, I, I no. don't care. It, it's who are you, wait, who are you, whose input is invalid? Me. Gar's. Okay, okay like, make sure you qualify that, because people listening don't know who you're talking to. So which historical figure does his powers come from? He's, well, this is like his base form. Apparently. All of their base forms are just based on themselves. So he's Benedict Cumberbatch. He's sure. A, he's a necromancer. How about you? Well, we do know that the two other forms that he uses are Grim and Sanzo. I really like. I really like this suit, though. Can we get a full body? Cool. Do we have a full body? No, no, no. this is all we have right it's now. It's just on the cover which, magazine. Which is why I don't have like an opinion. On yeah. It. Well, once okay. I see the whole body suit, then I'll have an opinion. I have a very strong opinion about this, and it is that I am vastly disappointed that he does not have three horns. I was about to say three horns. I was about to say. I was looks like no. fucking ride trooper. No, no, no. Well, a little yeah. bit, yeah. yeah because the green visor is circular. No, yeah. no, I just realized something. It's Ben 10. Think about it. Green? Black. Oh my god, he uses a wrist. Dead. uses a wrist kinda. changer to change into heroes. Oh my god. Oh my I'm god. Yes. Yes. Did it. In the middle of a fight, he's just going to glow red, turn into a kid. <laughs> um, <laughs> Uncle Max, I don't know where I am now. Grandpa Max. Grandpa Max. Yeah. When? Anybody? Okay, you guys. You're, you're, I'm gonna totally kick your asses. Just give me ten I, minutes. When the Omnitrix times back in, I'm totally gonna go forearms on you. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm glad he doesn't have three Fucking horns. Ass. I, I'm okay with that. Okay, it's officially he's my favorite rider because he's like Ben 10 related. <laughs> so, uh, it's also speculated at this point that he will actually be working for the Ganma. And, yeah. that, and, that, and that he is a creation of Alan's using the technology from the Ghost Rider. You know, again, I is... love the bad guy's name is Alan. Alan. I know. I actually, really... I actually really like him. His, like, the clothes he wears, are, the clothes he wears it's, are it's, cool. The it's not a name that English inspires today. fear, is it? No, it's not. But Lord the... of the Ganma, destroyer of the living. Alan. Well, technically he's the prince, but we'll get into uh, that when we talk about the episode. See, if the, if this was in a visual form, I could actually just post up a single panel from Rat Queens. Oh no! Shit! It's Dave! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You hear that, Dave? Okay. Well, if yeah, that's cool that Necrom's actually a, a villain writer then, because... Well, it's not confirmed, but that's the rumor. Quick yeah. question. I, I believe it. Think he'll go the way of Chase? I... You know, I hope he doesn't. I hope we have an actual evil writer for the show. Now, quick question: Did we ever talk about Ghost's like power up form boost? Yeah, we did talk about Tokan Several boost. Several times. In the same magazine scan, we got a real nice headshot of Tokan boost Damashi. Yeah, that's fucking cool. The yeah. fucking horn is glorious. This is like now. Now they're really fucking pissing me off, though. That is full on Ghost Rider. Oh yeah, that's like Marvel Ghost Rider. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This Heads on fire. This actually segues into my next news story quite well because it was the uh, reveal of the Ghost Tokan boost figure. As well as a good shot of the icon. Jesus That's cool. Right. That's pretty cool. Wait, that looks like one of Satan's testicles. <laughs> scroll, scroll back up to that outfit, though. And the... the Wait. Is he channeling the power of Rocky? <laughs> yeah, I, was, it. I was gonna say, yeah, he looks like a boxer here. Yeah. It was right. Muhammad, did he have Muhammad Ali's soul trapped in there? Because I think that might piss off some people. <laughs> Including Muhammad Ali, because isn't he still I think alive? One of yeah, the, yeah, I think he is. <laughs> <laughs> I think one of, the rumors go, one of the rumors going around, based on what we know about the movie so far, is this form might actually be based off his father. Hey, I'm Rocky Balboa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Muhammad Ali is still alive. Yeah, of course he is. Yeah, he's, yep. he's just got, like, really bad Parkinson's. Yeah. <laughs> hey... Like we he's judge alive and tweeted. Yeah. I don't. No, no. My he... father has Parkinson's. Yeah. No, he's just making the comment that Muhammad Ali has Parkinson's. Yeah. But yeah, that icon is. No, badass. that's badass. And it's about electronics and stuff. Yeah, it's got so. its own lights and sounds you know, in it. Lane, you're my friend, so I'm not gonna make a joke. If you look at this shot of it, like switching modes, it's like completely dark except for Holy red shit. ring, and then it like lights on fire Wait. when you activate it. It warms the cock. You know what? Ichi's getting it, so I don't have to. I probably will. Yeah. Probably. How would? Only probably. How would it I, I have actually gone back on things that I said I would buy. I didn't buy my own Ninja Star Burger. 
Even though I was pretty dead set on it. I was going to get it for you for your birthday, but then you Because it's else, stupid. So like, and it's always been Fuck stupid. you! And if I ever I want own it, the Ninja Star Burger, I and I'm damn well did. proud of it! And if I ever want to like, play with it, it's here anyway. Like, if, if they ever, I, only, I only got my own Ghost Driver because I had it customized. Like, like, listen. If they ever pass a law that you need to make an argument whether or not you're allowed to breathe... I'm going to produce that as Exhibit A, why you shouldn't. <laughs> hey, man. Wait. There's nothing wrong with having a hamburger-style uh, I thought it was toy thing. Awesome. Yes. Yes, there is. But Look, it, he's American <laughs> Sentai in America. Yeah, but that was the joke in the beginning. Then they just yeah. never went, went Well, yeah, no, that's that's why bother. Yeah. Why go anywhere else? More news. So you then... So um, I'll save my other comments till we actually. Yeah. yeah. So right. speaking of ghost power up forms, we got a. Stand. And his name is John Cena. Shut the fuck up. Get out. Oh. <laughs> also not dead yet, so he apparently can't be an icon. But that would be goddamn hilarious. Oh my god, that would be fucking hilarious though. Speaking of, I've got a new icon and it puts it in and it just shouts. And his name is John Cena. <laughs> <laughs> Does it not look like a WWE belt though? Okay. Yes, I agree with you on that. So. For people who aren't looking at the video version, what we're looking at now is... Because the we're in radio. <laughs> well, we have, like, a video version we put up on YouTube. Okay. So people will be seeing this. Um, what we're looking at now is the scan of the DX Icon Driver G, which we mentioned last week. Confirmed that it is the belt that requires having all 15 icons. Wait, 15? Yes, the 15 hero icons. Oh, right. That's and right. it actually... You, he uses this to go into his, his, like, super form, Grateful Damashi. Because Ghost, Grateful... Grateful Ghost. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, wait, wait. Did they just make a Moth fucking Grateful Dead reference? Yes, they did. Yeah. This show's awesome! <laughs> I'm so waiting for that Jesus icon. So, looking at this belt, we can see the emblems of all 15 heroes around the center of it, meaning he'll be able to switch between all of their powers at will. Kiwami. It's, it's literally uh, Kiwami Damashi. I'm still trying to figure out what the hell Beethoven has to do with anything. Beethoven! He, he, he flings He's magical musical notes. Shut up, that's still dumb. <laughs> But it makes the his form's opponents beautiful. go deaf. Yeah, and I, I actually really like Beethoven Damashi. Although I'm still pissed we haven't seen an actual Hisats from him yet. We'll wait. Anyways, yes, this Washa fucking... Fever. I don't know why this requires a separate belt, but yes, it looks like a goddamn wrestling championship belt. Also, fuck you, Raven. <laughs> well, no, it's going to go along with his other power-up form, where he looks like a boxer. <laughs> this is his heavyweight champion of the world which belt. Is, which is funny, because that's not the one that uses this belt. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I just I just like saying what I said before because every form Itchy likes doesn't get a he sots. Yeah, you bastard. Mm -hmm. There's also like a silhouette in the corner of this magazine scan of presumably it Grateful looks Damashi. Like shows that suit. It looks like this goes. form actually has three horns if you look at it. It looks like it should be fighting Godzilla. <laughs> it looks like it's got a crown. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. I, if you oh, look, look at all those Parker ghosts. Yeah. Name them all and you win Oh, $50. we actually see all 15 of them. That's cool. Yeah. I see, guess that one's me. Well, what I'm honestly surprised is that they're not just marketing a whole line of hoodies. That's I, what we were I talking about. I was saying about. yesterday, I was like, they need to just make dumb, dumbishy hoodies. Like, like they actually, oh my god. If you go to Bandai's website, you or whoever sells it, you can actually get a jacket, like a hoodie jacket that looks like Ore Damashi's Parker Ghost, but that's the only one they did. I would totally buy the Musashi fucking. Uh, I know you would. I would buy Spectre. Uh, they, they did do Spectre. They did do Spectre. I know they did Makoto's jacket, but I didn't. Did they do the actual Spectre Damashi? Yes. God damn it! But the problem is, they definitely don't make it in my size. And they're expensive as shit. Yeah, a Japanese company would generally not make anything in any of our sizes here, except for Lane. Because I asked <laughs> no, because I asked my middleman about it, and he said if I wanted to get the shirt and the hoodie, it would be like at least two hundred dollars. Like, yeah, that's Lane, not surprising. Lane at all. is the one person here who's managed to wear a Kamen Rider boat without modifications. Yeah, that was like five years ago, though. So the point is, you get it. All Can't fat do it anymore. Man. Then again, the Kamen Rider belts, to be fair, are made for children to wear. So yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, we are not the size of Japanese children. Yeah, but I was a skinnier fucker back then, so... Yeah. It, oh, no, yeah. <laughs> Still a pretty skinny Still fucker. am, but... G I, I have muscles now. I just realized, Kamen Rider G confirmed. Anyways... As much as I like Kamen Rider G, fuck you. I oh. This belt's actually cool. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm not getting... Wait, wait a minute. investing in the ghost line as much, but I like that it's a giant icon. That's, wait, that's Kamen Rider cool. G, that was the, the, the wine one. That was the wine one. Yes, yes. the wine Which Rider. I loved. That was beautiful. No. Thank not, you. Just, can I just... 
lane. Yeah. Not investing in the ghost line, he says with the ghost right Not <laughs> much of the ghost line. You the, didn't the hear I said he, not much the of the ghost line. The ghost line that he was line. playing with the whole time we were trying to have other conversations. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, um, the, this driver is where I'm going to have to call. I will wait to see it in action before I decide on it. Yeah, no, it looks really cut. There's that huge white space in the middle, and I'm not sure if that's supposed to be light. Oh, oh no, looking. It's, it's a glare. It's a, yeah, it's a magazine scan. So yeah. it's literally belt. someone took a picture of a Well, I don't know, because the it's in every shot. An eyeball. Yeah, uh, oh, that's what it is. Uh, yeah. Uh, like if you look at that bottom corner image, yeah, no, the entire yeah. belt is a fucking eyeball. Oh, yeah, because there's a shot of it in standby yeah. mode, like the icons. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, which means this centerpiece right here is probably what the Damashi's face will look like. Wow, cool. that's silly. Wait, <laughs> one horn, two horn, three horn. Yeah, right up. We already said that. Three horn. Moving oh. on. <laughs> ah ah oh. ah! I got some news. Okay. The new Godzilla movie got the trailer. What? Oh, yeah. yeah. The new Godzilla movie. Well, after news, we're taking what? a break. <laughs> wait, wait, which got wait like Japanese, Japanese Godzilla? Japanese okay, Godzilla. Japanese All right, Godzilla. thank you. It's called a Godzilla Resurgence, and we also. And we're also getting a new Ultraman movie for its 60th anniversary. Oh, where really? Ultraman X will team up with the Ultraman that helped him out throughout his run in the show. With Ultraman Tiga and the original Ultraman. Cool. And he'll get a brand new form called Exceed X. I guess Super really wasn't enough. Okay. Next time. Uh, but Super is very good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as Dick Ranger taught us. They literally, Super is very good. Okay, comrade Deno actor Takaru Sato oh. cast in new Japanese film if cats disappear from the world. Yeah, okay. Well, okay. Other Anyways, news. Moving, moving on. on. Moving on. Uh, if cats disappear from the world. Speaking of more icon news. Yeah. We already talked about this. No, but now we have more info on it. So we got some official images of the Ganma Icon set, which is apparently three separate toys. A normal Ganma Icon, uh, the version that is Spectre's sister, Canon, and Javel's version. Here's the problem. In the, if you're watching the video version, swap back and forth between the regular one and Javel's one. Does anyone see a difference? Because I, do. I don't! No, no, I the do. angle I do. is uh, slightly J different. Javer's is silver, it looks yeah. like, on the back. Yeah, see? It's got a bit, a bit more of a... I don't know, smooth. that looks pretty close. No, yeah, I can tell. It's silver. Yeah, yeah no, see? It, Black silver. It's, it's almost not noticeable. No, it, it totally isn't. It's just the same thing with a different backing. And now it's gone metallics. <laughs> Shut up. As much as I love Metallics, fuck you. Could that just be the episode of X or X or <laughs> Just fuck you. Fuck as, you as much as I love blank, fuck you. Yes. <laughs> uh, apparently this is a premium Bandai set that does contain all three icons, apparently. Uh, each icon is 50 millimeters tall, 85 millimeters long. Uh, each, the set costs 4320 yen at retail and is set for a release in March. Wait, Apparently, they're only accepting 5,000 orders for this. Meh. Because they know how I popular know. these are going to be. Now you two can pretend that your little sister's soul is trapped in a tiny eyeball. Bonita. It needs to pretend. Yeah, no, that was creepy. But no, if they, oh, yeah. If they ever release them as candy toys... It's even like, got the blush. Or, like, just the, the iconic one... I, I will get it, but I mean, it's, it's one. not. But <laughs> moving on, Gar, <laughs> shut up. Yeah. Um. We also got confirm confirmation. Confirmation. Can we not? <laughs> is that a bag with a hat on it? No, that's this is the Da Vinci gun yeah, from, from, the movie, from the upcoming movie. It and looks like a bag wearing a hat. A okay. Hat can like I can I make a mention of something really quickly? So when we were watching the new ghost episode just in the opening they're showing more clips of the drive ghost movie yeah i know literally that. this fucker's throwing mona lisa's at him yeah i was like oh my god that's yep. so stupid also i and just yeah, and yet expected also, i just said this really quietly to derek but i don't think we've ever actually pointed this out on the podcast Da Vinci Ganma's hat is one of Da Vinci's flying Yeah, Yeah, I'm sure. I think the, someone you know mentioned what, though, it. I, actually, I, lo I like the look of the icon itself. Yeah, I, ha I haven't even said it yet. Yeah, they're releasing the actual Da Vinci Ganma icon, which is a unique design, which is not bad. It's pretty. It's another premium Bandai. Uh, Pre-orders start on December 11th. They're only taking 6,500 orders of this one. Uh, and it's set for a release in May. 
Uh, no, man, they really know what their market well, is like. Well, it's also a three-piece set because apparently there's the other two as it well. It really bugs me how everything they ever release is no less than five months further down than the release of the thing it's actually shown off in. Be- because they have to, you know, like work within. Yeah, they're gonna make them. But no, we, we we're also getting two more, which is if this thing will scroll down. Michelangelo. Are and... uh, you talking about the other? Yeah, can't we movie? just get all four turtles? Well, yeah, that's a weird thing. Like, we talked about this earlier, but they're also showing uh, yeah. Raphael Ganma and Michelangelo Ganma. Fuck Donatello. Oh, yeah, oh, like, yeah, no yeah. for Donatello. They're even doing Javel's icon, which I i don't know why I didn't show up in my news. Wait, wait, wait. There's a secret one. Oh. You mentioned that Donatello? You mentioned, you mentioned please that Javel's be Donatello. It's got to be Donatello. Set. It has to. But, but you know what? No, there no, aren't no. any blue accents oh, in this one. But so. it, it didn't show the picture of, like, his the henchin form in the other one. Like, the icon actually has a, like, a battle form, kind of like oh. Da Vinci's. It's probably but... why you can use in the Ghost Driver. Yeah, I don't know, maybe. What? Um, moving on to our next story, possibly last. We oh, have mo- We have more news about the Kamen Rider Battle Ride War Genesis game that's coming out. Genesis. Shut up. He did not us. Apparently, not only is the voice actor for Takashi Hongo returning, but many others are. Uh, you can play as Takashi Hongo. Yeah. You don't even have to be transformed. You're just Hongo. You can just no, play as Hongo. No, and then there's a special DLC where you can play as Takashi Hongo in a combat man suit. Shocker. As a Sinto. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, Shocker. Yeah, from the man. episode where they broke into the freaking Shocker headquarters disguised. Or the mo- or the second movie, Kamen Rider vs. Ambassador Hell. Yeah. So, oh my god, we are such nerds. Yeah. Yes. So here's the list of who's confirmed to return so far. Confirmed nation. Shut up. Shun Nishime, Ryoma Takeuchi, and Yuenaba reprising their roles as Ghost, Drive, and Mock, respectively. Yay. We also have Ryota Murai, who is decades Kuga. Yep, I know. Uh, Yuichi Nakamura, who is Zeranos. Shigeki Hosokawa, who is Hibiki. Weird. Really? He's coming through? Yeah. That's As awesome. well as Joji Shibui, who played Ibuki. He's been in Ooh. several series, though, at this point, so not surprised. Which one, Ibuki or Hibiki? Ibuki? Wait, is Ibuki the one with the guitar? No, no that's the, the trumpet. trumpet. That's, that's, that's Zanki and Todoroki. Okay. I only care about the man with the guitar. There's two of them. That's who I thought I was. Wait, he once old jammed old out on a monster after stabbing it with his guitar. That's the monster Todoroki. Exploded. That's yeah. Todoroki. Yeah. That's what. That's what got me into like watching Hibiki was a shot of that scene. What are they calling him? A A U Kuga Alternate Universe. Yeah, Kuga. Alternate Universe Kuga. That's fine. Um, <gasps> Kohei Murakami, who plays Kaiza, is yeah. returning. Oh. Satoshi Matsuda, who plays Knight. Oh. Damn. Tetsuo Karada, who plays Black. Slash Kamen Black. Uh, as well as, as uh, aforementioned, Hiroshi Fujioka, who played Ichigo. No, su- actually, no, actually, actually, actually with, Apparently not. With, Maybe, oh. I don't know. Uh, so wait, 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 double? Kaiza's back, but they didn't bring Faiza's actor in to do that. I don't know. Even well, though they've we, both been in recent Yeah, but, but it Maybe also they'll depends confirm on... Later. Who you can, it also depends on who you can get, though. I was like, if like some, some of them may have other commitments, or they may just not want to come back to it. Well, we know it's Fi- uh, for Philip fives. I don't. For Pardon? Fun? Philip from Double will never come back because he says he's too old to portray Philip anymore. And, which I don't necessarily and, agree with. But as for Fives from Deno is just gone because he's he's got a career. They, now. they can't afford him anymore. Yeah, but as for <laughs> yeah, Fives, I don't think. I don't think uh, Hanta Kenda is a case of not wanting to yeah, come back. Yeah, because he's been he, in the last couple movies. Because he, yeah, Kamen Rider Yango was literally about him. But they, they may just not have been able to get him. No, that's what it has to I be. Because that, that was what happened with uh, some of the Power Ranger stuff as well in the past. Yeah. They just haven't been able to get in touch with someone. Yeah, which, which, which is fine. No, with the 20th anniversary of Power Rangers, Saban literally did not send emails to any of the Disney Rangers. Just like Mighty Morphin to Wild Force. Yeah, but and they then, had the they had the same thing with uh, Forever Red though, as I recall, with yeah. uh, one of the guys. They just couldn't get a hold of him. Oh, uh, Steve Carganis. Yeah, because yeah. he was moving. Yeah, him. yeah, but I mean that it's just the case sometimes. I mean these guys have real lives. It's funny, Steve Carganis was just on an episode of The Completionist where they played the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie game. Of course he was. I watched that video. That was fun. Um, yeah, so this is who's confirmed to return so far. Uh, apparently the game celebrates the 45th anniversary of the franchise and features the sudden disappearances of various Kamen Riders. Please, Forze. Please, Forze. Again. And the only Wasn't way Wasn't that the plot of the, la- of the first one? Uh, it's hard to tell. The plot. No, are... the, the, the last Battle Ride War game was they, were, they infiltrated the movies. That, that was the second one. Yeah, I was talking about the first one. Oh, the first one? Wasn't that the plot of the first one? Everyone just fucking disappeared. 
I don't remember the plot of the It is a one. nice way to explain why all these other writers who they couldn't get the actors for uh, aren't in yeah, the Yeah, the, the writers are disappearing are the ones they couldn't get the voice of. I think we were creating, or like going into the first episodes of each writer would yes. be fucking interesting as all hell. That's, yeah, the idea is we're going to be replaying, in that game we're going to be replaying first episodes of different shows. Dude! Apparently the way they do this, and god damn it, we're going to be seeing lots and lots of use of the Denliner apparently. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, Deno. basically. Just your eyes just went wide right there, yeah. Derek. See, here's the for Deno is a wonderful show. If Common Rider Deno himself never appears in it, I know. Ex- right? I know. Right? <laughs> Everyone else in that show, all the other concepts they bring forth in it are really, really, really cool. It's just the writer is the most goddamn annoying person ever. That's why. I and I really you. just I want to see a show where it's um, owner uh, Sakichi Nur- uh, Narumi. Um, the first, um, was, uh, the Go Ranger, the red one, um, Acker Ranger? Acker Ranger, yeah. Um, and there was, like, one or two other characters, and it's just the old man team, <laughs> where they fly around the, oh, and, uh, Gavin, and they just fly around on the Den Liner through history fighting evil, <laughs> and it's just the old man team. Oh, no, no. Cool. And only, Three like, of Gavin. Because he's played three oh different, he's played three different Sentai yeah, yeah. members, um, which they put out. And, no, and uh, and Ichigo, and it's like only three guys on this team have superpowers. Yeah. Well, okay, and Skull, um, and they just go around. And Odor sits back in Denliner drinking coffee. Well, these and guys are rice. fighting. Pardon? And eating rice. And eating rice. Well, these guys are fighting evil, and they get back on. He's like, okay, we have to go to another spot to save time. There, there was just that point in the Decade episode with Deno where he comes in, he's like, there are still rips of the fabric time. I'm like, oh my god, they're just going to play the Doctor Who music now. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I just realized something. So, it, I think, like, if you go to, like, the first episodes of each Rider series, but it's, like, something fucked up so they can't, like, you know, their episode isn't complete. Which means that if we get to the Gaim portion, you'll actually, ha- to save the first episode of Gaim, you have to help Gaim kill Yuya. <laughs> so, so you like you have to team up with Gaim to kill you yeah, if you want Gaim's plot to move on forward. Oh god, that's totally a valid point. Yeah. Jesus well, Christ! So sweet. But it means you can connect though. The first episode of Gaim though, you can have a rhythm game in there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, so what the what the fuck is the first episode of Hebe gonna be about? He didn't even transform in the first episode. It was just I'm him sure, on a boat. I'm sure they'll condense the first no, couple of episodes. He didn't, episodes he didn't transform until the second episode. I, oh, I'm pretty okay. sure that's true. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I've only ever saw the first episode and I watched him transform. Here's the thing. The By first episode, they probably mean first, like, plot arc. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. Nagito, like, he just showed up out of the fuck out of nowhere. Wait, guys, guys, there's one more piece of news. Oh, there's, now, oh, there's I, always yeah, one yeah, there more is. piece of news. Yeah. Well, before you move on, I'm just going to point out that the game, which will feature 45 playable riders, wow. is, is set for a release February 25th, and I'm fucking pre-ordering the shit out of it. So you can get the freaking Ichigo DLC? And you better Not have even just, some way to play it in North America. Uh, I have a, it's, it's on Vita, and also PlayStation is not region locked. What, fuck, seriously? Yeah, yeah. that's I, legit. Motherfucker! Yeah, I'm buying it for Vita, and then I can hook it up to my PlayStation. That was one of the selling console. points of the PS4. Yeah, you remember how the PS3 wasn't region locked? This one won't be either. Fuck's sake! Awesome! Yeah, so... February 25th, you say? Yeah. Gar. Hit up yes. Asia or whatever. What do you gotta say? Uh, the new Superhero Tyson film has been announced. Uh, Super- oh, right! Uh, Superhero Tyson Ishiomori. Yeah. All Shotaro Ishiomori created heroes in one movie. Skullman versus Kamen Rider yeah, Skull. I was gonna Do it. Say, I was I suggested this, Raven. I'm like, they should make Skullman an actual thing so, for the movie. <laughs> Do not. I like the confusion in like, Raven's face. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm both. I'm simultaneously excited and horrified. <laughs> but no, okay. Basically, Go Rangers like Super Sentai is not gonna be there. Oh yeah, not all Shinomori. the Kamen Riders are gonna be. There. But this is the funny thing in the newsletter. It says, "Do not expect to see." See the Mellow Heroes, quotation, they were not created by Ishiyamori. Yeah. Thanks for clarifying. Yeah, it's like, thanks for clarifying that. I but know. I can just see it right now. Original Kikaider, meaning reboot Kikaider. <laughs> Nazman, fighting with modern day Nazman. Then we get Kikaider 01. And then, and then Zubato again. Then Comrider Ichigo versus Comrider the First. No, no, <gasps> no, 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 shut up, shut up. Blake 17 shows up and they're like, yo, I'm a motherfucking robot. Let's take this guy down. 
And then Skull Man's gonna be the exclusive And then Gavin guy. just shows up and, and then Drew Ozier shows up and quickly does a Megazord fight. No, no, no. And then, like, Featuring oh. Drew Ozier. That's how Ghost gets. Because it's superhero no, no, taste. No, no, and they Ghost is gonna be in there, and that's how he's gonna get the Ishinomori icon. Oh, fuck! And, yeah. and it's not gonna be Ishinomori, it's gonna be a Skull Man. Where it's completely silver. I hope. I a think man this was the, can dream. I think this was the longest news segment we've ever done. Yeah, yeah. fuck. I went on tangents. This no is tangents why they invite happen. me onto the radio. Welcome to <laughs> Cast Ranger. Welcome to welcome to Tangent Sent. Welcome to Tangent Sentai Cast Ranger. Oh. Oh uh, yeah. So that's it for the news. Hope you all enjoyed. And Derek will be joining us for the Cast Ranger episode proper. So stick around and click the next link. Bye. Unless you watch. Be seeing you. Boop.